What I'm looking forward to camp is getting to know um, all my friends better and just spending time with each other. Uh, what I'm looking forward to camp is having fun and um, hanging out with friends. My favorite thing about camp is hanging out with my friends. The best thing that happened at camp was the food. Uh, I enjoy like setting up the cabin. I think Katana will probably snore the loudest. I think Demi will get the most sunburn. Katana's going to shower the longest. We couldn't sleep, so no one slept last night. Like literally, no one even got one hour of sleep. Everyone was up last night, and we were all talking, so it was kind of funny. One of the greatest importance of worship at camp uh, is not simply to get a camp high. One of the things that I hope that we see here at camp something that I think a lot of our students are seeing is that camp is meant to be a place that's supposed to charge them to carry on and sustain a lot of what they're learning. So a lot of these things that we're seeing, uh, they're not all for naught. They're, they're songs that reflect scripture. And so for us here, when we sing these songs, we want them to know the truth of the gospel as they sing it and they take it home. I had the opportunity to see God's love through worship and now years later I can still come back to the camps and see the kids and just show them that you can love Jesus through worship and it's not just at school it can be even after and maybe give them an opportunity to see that there's just so much more. I feel like God has been moving a lot at camp. Um, last night's chapel which was Wednesday night chapel, the first chapel, um, it felt like really fun and that's really good for a camp environment but um, I think this morning, which was Thursday morning, Thursday morning chapel, um, especially since we were talking about the bad news and how sin has come into the world, it felt like God was moving and He was present. Um, that's one of the themes of our school this year is like be present. And I think God was um, very present this morning. I could tell that the kids were paying attention and they were being impacted because um, our family group discussions were really good. Um, we had a lot of discussion and me and my other counselor, we got to share testimonies and um, I think that was super good for the kids because they were able to like see where I am and my faith journey and like how I'm so similar to them because I was like once in their place. I would really want the kids to have that moment where they, they hear the song and they're listening to the lyrics and they're like, wow, that really applies to my life. And just, they have that moment of realization where they're like, like for me, when we were singing Build My Life today, and it's like, I will build my life upon your love. It really spoke to me because that's like what my testimony has been, like growing up in a Christian home and making that faith my own by building upon that foundation that I had, right? And it, it made me like tear up thinking about it. And I really hope that some of these kids hear a song and they're like, wow, like, like Jesus really did die for me. Or like, wow, like I really do have a good foundation that I should build upon. Um, and that they just have that moment where they feel really connected with God because that's like that's more meaningful than any jumping or clapping will ever mean. I think that just here at camp it's just amazing to see the kids when they sing and they need chances like that to just express what they feel the love of God is like. Something I hope the kids really take away is the fact that God loves them so much and that He has a plan and a purpose for their life 
and that even through the hard times, God will make a way for them, and that He will bless them, and He will just make them great people.